All right, all right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to City Skylines After Dark. I'm, of course, the Conflict Nerd, and today I have some mods enabled. I did some testing, I did a live stream, in fact, and I tested to see what mods were working, and it turns out quite a few of them are, including network extensions, including Traffic Manager, the Traffic Report tool, we have City Vitals, and uh, there's a couple more in there as well. I also, I, I, during my live stream, I did some toying around with the bus station, which is incredible. This is the best addition, aside from the day-night cycle, which, to be fair, the day-night cycle comes to the game for free, uh, with a con with just a patch, and update, as opposed to the, you know, the, the whole update, patch, expansion! That's the word, expansion, that's the word I was looking for. But the, the, the bus station is incredibly good. It is just the best thing. I love it to bits. Anyway, anyway, we have some demands here. We have demand for industry or offices and also for residential. And I want to sort of deal with that demand. Now, obviously, we have a lot of zoned... We, we've zoned a lot of um, commercial around here. And I want to uh, sort of remove some of that. I'm going to go ahead and remove commercial here. And I'm going to replace it with some... Oh, I can't do offices yet, can I? That's a fair point. When can I do offices? That is 6,500 people. Okay, in that case, I think I will just leave this bare for the time being. I'll leave it as it is. I think it's fine. Although, what I... What I would quite enjoy doing is perhaps replacing this road. I think I want to, um... Well, I need to see. I mean, yeah, they, they are turning left. They can actually turn left from that central lane. Yeah, they are they are turning left from that central lane, but they're just not really... I don't know. I'm not convinced by these roads. I think traffic plus plus is something that I kind of need, because technically they shouldn't turn left from that lane, but they do, because they obviously can't go in the bus and taxi lane. So, I don't know. I'm not entirely sold by that. I'm not entirely keen on it, but uh, I think it's okay. Now, where is our taxi station? There it is. 18 of 25 taxis in use, so we don't actually need another taxi, what do you call it? Also, another mod I got was the auto bulldoze, so we won't have to deal with the uh, abandoned buildings anymore, which is fantastic news. I'm so happy about that. I love this game, but I don't love dealing with abandoned buildings, I'm going to be honest. Uh, let's bring that in here. Let's run a road up to there. There we go. We can get a little bit more commercial, just uh, commercial, residential just in there. Uh, we'll also go ahead and just tear out that and do residential there as well. Fantastic. So hopefully that'll deal with a little bit of the demand. I'm also thinking I could totally do... I don't know what way to do this, actually. I could do a road there, but it is very close to that junction. But then again, on this side, it'll be close to that junction. So I think... I think I'm going to do a road here. Uh, coming down like that. And we're going to put some... We're going to dezone you. We're going to put residential there and a little bit of uh, commercial just there. All right, so that'll fill in that gap. We sort of need to do something similar with this space, I think, just to fill it out. So something like that could be useful. With once again a little bit of a uh, little bit of residential just there. That'll fill out the space and make it look good. Lots of traffic moving there. Bit of a backup here, which isn't great. Now, the good thing with having Traffic Manager, again, is that I can turn off traffic lights. I just don't know that that's necessarily the best idea. I can also change lanes. I don't remember what exactly this does. Oh! Oh, so I can actually do this. I completely forgot that was a thing. Okay, so I can actually set up where these lanes can go. That's fantastic. That means if I go to here, I can set that to forward only and stop them from U-turning. Good, that is uh, that is exactly what I want to do. So these guys can now legally or properly turn left and those guys back there cannot U-turn, which is exactly what I want. Good, we do need to rename Thornton Industrial Park. So we're gonna go back to, uh, we'll go to Thornton Park. That'll do, Thornton Park will be the name of that. It will be, uh, in fact, the Thornton Strip could be a good one there. The, the Thornton, uh, strip because eventually I could see us putting some interesting stuff on there also 
Excuse me. Yeah, that, that was that was what the also was, by the way. I just needed to clear my throat. I will be honest. I'm recording this on the same day that I recorded the previous three episodes. Just after a three-hour live stream. So, my throat is a little bit short right now. I've... <laughs> My throat has been in better condition. We'll just put it that way. Uh, let's deal with some of this industrial demand because it's it's getting up there. Also, this traffic the uh, traffic here could get a little bit a uh, little bit tricky at some point. But uh, we'll deal with the industrial demand that we have. I would just like to obviously set up this district here, make it look all fancy and nice. The Briar Rose district. Maybe Briar Rose and oh for God's sake no 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 let's make that properly uh, maybe Briar Rose Industrial could be a a good name there we'll see we'll see I mean it's it's not the worst sign now for God make it properly this needs to be perfect I think it's per that is pretty perfect don't mind if I do look at that that's uh, that's pretty fab apparently there's power problems I'm not exactly sure where these power oh you. Wait, what? Oh yeah, I placed you down there and I never actually put the, uh, I never actually ran the pipe to you, did I? That's, uh, because it was like five grand to do it. Uh, it's probably cheaper to run it to there, huh? Yeah, less than half the price. So we'll do that and we'll put this, uh, well we could put one of these in the water. Yeah, we'll do that, that'll keep that powered. Little bit over, little bit of overkill there, we don't really need something that powerful for it, but that's fine. Uh, we'll now go ahead and get rid of this, get rid of this. And demolish these power lines just here. Uh, there we go. There we go. And just along here as well. Okay, that has actually caused some issues because these guys don't have enough electricity. Uh, what we should probably do is run a line from there to there to... Come on. Uh, from there to there. Right, that'll connect that. Did we we did get the coal power plants, didn't we? So we should probably... Oh, it is connected to everywhere. Okay, well in that case, I want to go ahead and get rid of this. And I also want to get rid of this. Because it's a little bit silly. And I also want to fill in this space a little bit. I'm not quite sure what way to go about doing this, but I want to fill it in. And I'm bloody well gonna do it, is what I'm gonna do. I'm, I'm gonna figure out a way. I'm sort of feeling that the best way might actually be to rip this road out and relay it. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna rip that road out. I'm gonna get rid of the uh, get rid of the pathways. There we go. Let's uh, do that. Now what have we got? So that is coming off a bridge. Let's see. I also would just like to point out I forgot how uh, how epic the music in this game could be from time to time. I think what we'll do here actually is run that to there. Is that two blocks long? I don't think it is. Oh, we'll just connect them. There we go. We'll just connect them up. Uh, what we'll do now is dezone that, fill all of that space in. What the hell is that? Oh, it's a... Uh, why is that? An, it's at an angle? Oh, yeah, the road there was at an angle, wasn't it? Uh, get rid of you. Get rid of you. Okay, so... That's all of that space filled in. What I would like to do is just dezone those and fill out that space. Then I'd like to come in with more commercial, just feel like that space. And then down the sides, I think... I'm actually thinking get rid of those, put commercial in, and we're good. And the same down this way. No, I think residential. I, I think residential there. There is... there's an interesting balance of residential and commercial here. I'm actually liking doing this. This could turn into a really good city center if I decide to upgrade all of it at some point. Also, do we have... No, we can't get anything yet. That is uh, that is fine by me. We're we're growing. This, this place is definitely growing. We're getting more people. Also, I never actually solved the industrial demand issue. That is something I should probably do. Not entirely sure how to go about doing it since I don't really want to just continue in a straight line. I also don't think there'll be an industrial. Well, I guess there could be an industrial zone there at some point, but. We'll see, we'll see. Let's, uh, let's... Let's have a think. Let's, let's have a think about this. So we have this industrial strip right there. Briar Rose District, which will go to, uh, Briar Rose... 
not district in dust reel. There we go. So Briar Rose and Dust Reel. I mean, I could expand it out, but yeah, I'll, I'll expand it out. We'll expand this. Oh, I can't expand that way. No, oh, there's a fire. Yeah, fire station. Okay, firehouse. Uh, you can move down a little bit. So I'll expand this way by two blocks and two blocks, and then across. And then do I want to? What do I want to fill this space in with? Because I guess that works. I just don't know that I want to do it that way. What about short of... Oh, I can't do it that way either. I want to go just short of two blocks. Okay, so I guess... Two that way and then... There. That seems... That seems good to me. Then I can fill those gaps in with some pathways. So on this side we'll do a pathway. And then on this side we'll do a cycle lane. There we go. That seems fine to me. Then I guess we could... No, we don't really need to connect them, do we? That seems good. Although I think I'd much rather do this a slightly different way. I don't think cycle lanes are necessary in an uh, industrial setting, so I don't think I'll bother with them. Although I really want them. Oh, I don't know. It's, it's, it's tempting. It is very tempting to go for a cycle lane. It just... It doesn't make a lot of sense, does it? It really doesn't. It, there's no, there's no sense in it. Oh no, I'm looking at this and I'm thinking I should totally put a road up there. Yeah. That looks weird, but I kind of like it. Let's go with that. Let's do some industrial zoning there. Let's give them some water. Uh, just around that little area. I'll not zone on the outside of that just yet. I'll leave it as it is. But I would like to come in here and just expand our district like so beautiful briar rose industrial has a nice expansion that'll hopefully that yeah there we go that's building so quickly good lord that was uh that's remarkably quick that is that is remarkably quick i love it okay i'm actually thinking i might take out a loan i know i don't need it but i mean i'm 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 gonna take out a sixty thousand money loan and I'm going to get myself a bus depot or depot and I'll put it down here because I really do want some buses I really do I want the buses I want to be able to have you know a reasonable system for public transport this isn't gonna be something I focus on just yet I did mention previously that I do want to focus on public transport but I don't want to do it just yet so what I think I'll do is I'm gonna set up two initial lines. Also, when do when do I unlock this? 42. Okay, we're gonna hold on then. We'll not do it just yet because I want the bus station as well. How much is the bus station gonna be? Uh oh my god, 65,000. Right. That's why it's so powerful then. Okay, we're not gonna be getting there. We're not gonna worry about it. Let's just pause then. And what we're gonna do is create two bus lines, one from here. Uh, to... Oh, this is going to be awkward, actually, isn't it? Okay. Start... There, perhaps? Sure. Start on that highway. That's very strange. Uh, I'll make this work, though. Then come up this way. Uh, go... Maybe not... No, like that. That's fine. Then come down... And sort of around this area, not going directly into the district except for there, coming back. Then I want it to come over this way, up to the school. Uh, you can probably stop before you head out, then come into this district, uh, to there, to there, over to there, to there, then back down. You can probably stop on your way. No, don't stop on your way out. You'll block traffic. That's not a good idea. Uh, have this then come in here. Go to here. Go to here. And then look to there. So that bus goes about a large chunk of the city. Let's speed things up a little bit so I can actually see the bus. There it is. I would like to edit that. That's going to be bus line one. That is going to be... 
I guess that's technically a city loop. I'm just going to call it boss line one because it will be getting modified. So that's going to be... I think I can... I'll just leave... I'll make it a really strong blue. There we go. So that's boss line one. Now what I want to do is have a bus that goes from that same stop that stops there and that's fine then goes down into the industrial zone and then we'll have one that it, it can go up that way then back so it can stop there as well then it comes back it comes along this road I think I'll have it go there I guess that really that's a little bit tricky because of the the merging but we'll we'll have it stop there I suppose we'll chance that we'll have it stop there as well then we'll have it come back now it is going to have to loop around that whole area which is a bit tricky but we'll have it do it wait is it starting there Apparently it is. Okay, right, complete that line. So that's the second bus line, which is a lighter blue. There it is. I want to edit that to be a sort of brown color. There we go. So that's going to be dealing with the industrial zone. So that can take people there. The other bus line will deal with people, you know, just trucking them around, or I suppose technically bussing them around the rest of the city. I don't think we need traffic lights here. I, I don't think traffic lights are necessary there. I mean, I might be wrong, but I just, I'm, I'm not feeling them there. Uh, this is going to be a little tricky, to say the least, since there's a lot of buses currently trying to use that lane. Oh my god, that residential demand. I just noticed it. Good lord. Maybe we want to, uh... Maybe we want to do something about that. I'm thinking. I'm thinking that we break with tradition and we stop doing the grid-based system and have a nice curvy road along there. Or we could start doing some stuff down here. Now that could be fun. And I did enable some assets, which I absolutely love, such as the compact highway exit, which is a personal favorite of mine. Now, unfortunately, the slope is too steep bloody everywhere. Um, anywhere that can work here? Anywhere that's going to work. Anywhere. Ah, uh, there. Although it's just not going to work the way I want it to, is it? Uh, I might take the chance, though. I might take the chance and make some, like, luxury housing. No, I feel like this should be a leisure place. This will be for leisure rather than housing. Uh, let's do... Let's figure this out. So what I'm thinking is that first and foremost, I want to upgrade this road into that. And then I'm going to have this come down this way. It's going to be a bit pricey to do, but it should be fine. Have this come down that way. Uh, along the front there and stop. That'll be interesting. <laughs> that'll, that'll be interesting to deal with. Uh, then what I'd like to do is actually see if I can... Because what I really want is a road that sort of mirrors this. But I don't want a zone on the side that has the water. I sort of want to zone in the side that's pretty much against... You'll, you'll see what I want to do. I want to have this come down. Go to there. Go... Along like this. I'm not sure how well this is going to work, but I'm sure as hell going to try. Have it come down like this, and then... This little bit's going to be tricky because it needs to come to the, there and then go to there. That seems okay. It is totally going to render that section of road useless, though, so maybe not do that. And maybe do... Where's the... There's a thin section there, so we'll go to there. That's fine. Any more thin sections of uh, zoning? There is a little one there. It's not as thin, but it'll do. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put residential on this side. So that it's facing out towards the island and the river. And eventually this will be upgraded to be high density. And since we're using the international uh, theme rather than the European. Or the asset 
set, I suppose. That'll look really interesting when it's a bunch of high-rise buildings. Or it should look really interesting. As for this, I don't know what I'll actually zone here. I guess commercial, I guess offices or something, but right now it's fine as it is. That was a bit expensive to do, but that's fine by me. I think what I'd like to do is maybe try a different angle for this grid. So maybe come off of uh, come off of there at a 90 degree angle. Go three blocks, go two blocks, go back to the road. Maybe not. Maybe not straight back to the road yet. I just want to see if I can get a different a different look for the grid because we've done this you know, grid over here, the grid's very, it's all the same. I want to give it a different angle now, just to shake it up a bit. And actually, as much as I don't really want to connect these, that works perfectly. That actually works perfectly right there, so that is totally going to happen. Uh, let's see, is this the right distance? No, a little bit shorter. Uh, that is the right distance. So do that, and then not that, just there. Yeah, that's what I want. Uh, go a block, I suppose. Go another block there. Have this sort of... I guess that works. Yeah, that just looks a little bit different, I guess. And that's kind of what I wanted. Connect that to the road there. Sure. We can go with that. That's strange looking. That's a bit weird. Yeah, I, I like this. I like that this will be an interesting residential, commercial space is, is what it'll, it'll be a mix do some commercial in there do some residential in there uh, residential 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 along that back road we'll do commercial down this side and then I think along the front here will be commercial again this is all planning this is all assuming that we can you know get ourselves some high density stuff which I mean I say assuming it'll be no problem to get that stuff it's just, uh, you know, waiting for it. Okay, that should be fine. Then I think that can be offices. So, all we need to do now is get some water to all of this place. So, let's just do this. Let's drag that down to there, up to there, to there. Follow the road down. And we're pretty much... Let's just make that a little bit of a mess. Bring that over to here and take that to there. There we go. That is, uh, hopefully, going to be an interesting space for development. There's people building over there. No one really building along the front yet, though. Which I'm disappointed by, to be honest. A little bit disappointed by that. Uh, do I want to turn off... Do I want to turn off traffic lights there? I don't know that I do. I really don't know. Also, when do we get high density again? 6,500, so it's not going to be for a little while. Uh, that's okay. That's, that's going to happen. That's sort of the way it works. Uh, let's extend the electricity to this area, which is developed quite nicely there. I like it. I definitely like it. I think I should, uh, I should probably change, oh, what the hell? Why did they go that way now? I should probably add another stop or two. Oh, we're a busy town. We've got city planning policies, level four unique buildings, leisure and tourism unique buildings, oil industries, tourism specialization. Okay, okay. And we got a bunch of new roads, too. That's kind of fantastic. A lot of new buildings. Oh, my God. Bus station. There it is. Very expensive, though. Okay, okay. This is good. This is good. Let's, uh... I mean, we can't afford this. Well, we can. I just... I don't think it's a good idea to have it right now. Uh, let's... Can we get a new area? No. Okay, right. What I want to have a look at. It's in here, because we did just get the tourism and leisure thing, so we can actually get a a fishing pier now, which is interesting. Oh, that... Oh, it's so steep, though. That's such a steep bit of land. Is there... Are there any beaches or anything around here? No? I don't know that we're going to be able to use any of that stuff. That's a little bit worrying. I mean, we do have a riding stable. We have a skate park, which... I guess I'll add a skate park. Where's the, uh... Where's the school? Is that the school? That is the school. Alright, we'll put a skate park uh, right next to the school. There we go, that's actually had a pretty good effect. 
We also have the... We do have beach volleyball courts, which I guess could go right next to it as well. Make it look like the school's into their sport and stuff like that. Which I imagine they would be. There we go. What else did we get? So we got some stuff here. We have the fantastic fountain. And we have the luxury hotel. What else have we got? We've got the zoo, which needs the fishing pier. We need 5,000 squares of tourism specialization for the driving range. And for the casino, we also we need 5,000 squares of leisure. Okay. Very interesting. Very interesting indeed. Let's see. How's our fire coverage? Fire coverage is to be desired. Good lord. We could get one of these, but it's a little bit pricey, so I think we'll stick with one of the smaller fire stations. We'll just chuck it in there. That's a good bit of coverage. Healthcare, definitely to be desired, so we will chuck it in... I guess there? Policing! Where are we going to put a new police station? Because we definitely need one. I think over about there, this corner could be a good spot. So there we go. We are having some water problems, some sewage problems, and a, I did see a flash of electrical problems, but I think it definitely seems that water is our biggest issue right now. So let's go ahead and get another one of these. We'll actually get two of them while we're here. There we go. Link those up. We also have sewage issues, so we're absolutely going to want to, uh, well, unfortunately, get another one of those. When can we get this? 14,000 people. Good lord. Oh, I've made a terrible mistake. Would you like to know why I've made a terrible mistake? Because that water isn't really flowing away. That That is not flowing away. That's just staying there because there isn't actually much of a water flow. So that's totally just going to stay there. What would be the best thing for me to do then? I'm sort of thinking over here could work because then eventually... I don't know. I actually, I'm not too sure. We will have to work that out at some point. But uh, that that's that's not good. That is very not good. A little bit worried about that. Little bit worried. You guys don't have electricity, really? You do, though. You do have electricity. The electrical availability is fine. I mean, I can I get the... What about the oil power plant? That'd be... It seems that the oil power plant would be a significant increase in... Uh, yeah, let's, let's nab that. Very expensive, but then we're going to just sell the coal one. There we go. We're good. We're good. All right, so that should totally help everyone. It has. Lots of uh, housing coming in here, which is fantastic. A little bit of commercial zoning popping up here and there as well, which is also fantastic. Let's go ahead and see what we can do with, uh, I think, another grid. I think just add another... Just about another block onto that space. Let's go 90 degrees that way. Yeah, that should be fine. Then just fill that out with a nice big chunk of residential zoning. Just clean this little space up. Okay, that should be fantastic. And what we can even do is take that back a little bit. Because this can now connect like so. There we go, that's brilliant. What about, uh, we don't actually have, do we have a cemetery? We have one. Which is interesting. That is, that is very, very interesting. I realize I should probably customize this and have a look at the cemetery usage and at the landfill usage. And turn off crematorium and turn off incineration. There we go, so now we can see how those are coming along. Always keeping me in the know as to whether or not I have the ability to, you know, have more dead people. Essentially. There we go, let's fill out that space. This is definitely coming along, though. This is definitely coming along. Plenty- Oh, there's a problem. There's a problem. Traffic is now starting to back up. That is- that is not good. Yeah, this- this road is getting very busy. Over here seems okay. But uh, this road is starting to get very busy, which is going to need dealt with. I'm just not quite sure how to best deal with it. Because some of the traffic is just merging across so that it can turn left, but a lot of it is just going straight on. So I'm thinking... I'm, I'm thinking the best thing I could possibly do... 
might be to merge these two areas, like put a road from there to there, force them... Oh no, because that's just going to cause problems with this turn. Let's see. I think this is okay. I think part of the problem might be that traffic is having to go the whole way around to get to this area. I think we need a connection here somewhere. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to bulldoze this bit of, bit of highway. I'm going to bring a road straight off of there, and I'm going to just do... Let's see. Go block that way, go block that way. Okay, and then I want to connect the highway to it. This is my plan. Whether or not my plan works, we will soon find out. Let's see. So connect that to there. Uh, then we connect that to there. Then we turn that back around on itself. I probably... I probably want to turn traffic lights off there. And hope for the best. And then this, I guess, just needs to be looped on itself. I guess? I, I guess that's how that would work. Huh. Didn't really think about this, gonna be honest. Uh, let's get rid of that and get rid of that. Let's extend this... I do have these other roads, actually. I do have the, the four-lane road that came that's with uh, network extensions. Because then there's actually the four-lane road with turning lane as well. But I think this will be fine. I think we just go with a six-lane with bus lanes and stuff like that. So do that. A block that way and a block that way. And then what? I feel like this should probably connect to there. I feel like that's what I need to do. I feel like this needs to be upgraded. There we go. So that can be upgraded to there. Then this gets extended and connected. Okay, that's that's fine. That does make me want to dezone that space, though. That definitely makes me want to dezone that space. So that's that's a connection there. This could probably connect to there, but that seems a little bit a little bit silly. I don't know. I don't know what way to go about this. Let's see. Maybe. Maybe connect, because if I do if I do this, I can sort of curve it to there, I suppose. Then curve it to not quite there. Not quite there. Like that. That's a very steep thing, though. That's that's not that's not quite right. Let's see. So take it a block. Not even a block, really. Less than a block. Something like that. I guess that's okay. It's a bit of a mess, but it'll do for now. We'll see if that helps. It might help. Because it is now a looping system. That's the thing. It is now a system that is, uh... Sort of looping around. Which could be good. It might be what the city needs. We shall soon find out. I mean, this traffic's now all backing up. It's... It seems to be backing up because of the traffic coming off the highway. So that has immediately, immediately failed. It also probably doesn't help that uh, traffic... Yeah, we're going to need to split these up a little bit. We're going to need to split those up and we're going to need to move this exit further down, I think. So have it sort of come out like that. Can I have it nice and close to the road? Oh, I totally can. Perfect. Have it go to there. And go to there. So that should help a little bit. That'll, yeah. That allows them to do their thing and get out of here without really being interrupted by the rest of traffic. Yeah, that seems to be helping, which is exactly what I want it to do. Beautiful. That is perfect. That is exactly what I want. Maybe not the ideal way to have people enter and exit a city, but in my opinion, I think it's fine. So we're going to stick with that for the time being. Although... What I am noticing is that for some reason this is here. So let's just downgrade that. I feel like, you know what? You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to just downgrade that to a... Oh dear, that's not what I wanted. I'm going to downgrade that to the two-lane highway. And I'm going to do the same here. Uh, so that's going to be one lane, and then that's going to be two. Because we really don't need... We really don't need the three lanes. Because there's only two ways in, and then they can only go left or right. So they don't really need three lanes. So that's fine there. That's actually, 
Yeah, that's perfect. That seems to be the change that we needed to do there, so. I'm actually pretty pleased about that. I'm I'm pretty pleased about that. Let's see, what have we got over here? Quite a few abandoned buildings. I assume that's just because there's not enough workers. Is that because they're educated or because they won't make the commute? That's the question. That is that is the question at hand. That is the question that I'm probably not going to get an answer to. Oh well, whatever. Let's go ahead and put a cycle lane in here. Uh, just like so. We'll take it up that way. Sort of freeform it a little bit. Uh, freeform it to there and then connect it to there. There we go. Nice little cycle lane. I really love those things. I really, really love those things. Cycle lanes are just the best. I don't even know if anyone uses that. I can find out. Uh, actually, I don't know if I can. I don't know if this... Like that? Oh my god. Oh yeah, it's got it's got the things in the on the footpaths now because bikes use them. Interesting. That's very interesting. So what if I click on this? Yeah, it can't actually tell me if people use it because I don't actually I don't think anyone does use it. Interesting. That's very interesting. No one seems to be using that anymore, which is a little bit disappointing. Oh no, that one's used. That's always good. Okay, well it it okay, so the mods the mods, they kind of work. They might not be perfect, but they... They kind of work. That's what counts. They try. That's, that's, you know, it's, it's the thought that counts.